You know the type of sore throat that you feel when a cold is coming? I was feeling exactly that when I woke up on Monday, May 23rd. I wasn't thinking anything of it, it was bearable enough to the point that I could do my silly little tasks, but strong enough to constantly keep me aware of it as I went about my day. The next day, however, I woke up struggling. I thought it was only gonna be a matter of minutes until my head would explode. The sore throat had become worse, the cold was starting to show, and I had other symptoms that overall made me feel... unwell. So I decided to take a COVID test, because, you know, Ms. Rona is still among us. That night, after I feasted on painkillers, I was able to finally get my refreshing and relaxing two hours of sleep. So then the next morning rolls around, and I receive this message. And the rest was history. And in this video, you're gonna see how all that went. So I just got to the hotel, looking like shit, but I'm using this sudden burst of energy that I know it's gonna go away soon to give y'all a life update. We're doing great. Okay. So this is the bathroom. Wow, very nice. This is my hoodie that I hang up. Don't, don't look at that. Okay, I didn't know where to put it. Moving on. I mean, fridge, microwave, that, and a coffee machine. And this is the hotel. Two beds. We got a desk. It's already mess. Bedside table moment area. Closet. I can learn how to iron. Oh my god, it's gonna be so fun. There's not enough hangers for everything that I brought, which brings me into my next point. I overbacked. Realistically, I will be wearing the same thing for 10 days. And if you see me in the same hoodie every day, mind your business. I'm not seeing anyone, except you, like the whole internet, but I don't care. <laughs> this is the view. I need to go take a shower. See you later. Hello. <laughs> We are nice and showered. Now it's pitch black outside. But we postmated food and it just got here. So Give it up. Yes. We got kava. I love kava so much. I'm trying to figure out how do I turn on the light? Because oh my god, that looks so disturbing. What the f no, I'm gonna take it down. Yes, we got a little heat up right here. Oh, yes. Do y'all mix your bowls or do you just eat it separately? That's an important question. Cause I honestly just like leave it separate. There's so many things that go into the bowl that so many flavors are meshing together and you don't get the whole experience, so. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Mm -hmm. Kava never disappoints. Kava sponsor me, please. I love you. Day one! Good morning! 
The only thing about this place is that I don't have a freezer and I came prepared. I brought my ice tray and everything to make ice, but I don't have a freezer. So what do we do? I also need a shave. Anyway, what do we do? I know that hotels have ice machines that you can go to and fill your bucket with ice, but they didn't give me the keys to my room. So if I go out, I'll lock myself out of my room. I could like keep it open with something, but like, what if they see me outside, like running around? Will I get in trouble? Will I get deported? Will I get arrested? <laughs> so I'm calling room service. I'm calling the front desk because I don't know, I don't know how hotels work. Can you guys stay? <laughs> Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. That was easier than I thought. We got the ice. Oh my god, what was that voice break? Ice. I don't know how to freeze it. Good. They brought me so much, but and I don't, oh my god, can you stop? I don't know how to preserve it because I don't have a freezer. What if I set my fridge to a really high, I mean a really low temperature? So I'm editing right now. Always working. Healthy or ill, I'm always working for you guys. So that's why you should subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. Turn your notifications on so you know every single time you post and so that you can watch this pretty face all day every day. Okay, but what I wanted to say is that I just heard some noises outside. So that means, that might mean, don't look at that peanut butter on the bed. We're struggling, okay? What I meant to say was I heard some noises outside, which probably means that they delivered food. So we're gonna check. Food reveal. Food haul. Let's see. No seafood. One thing about me is if I eat seafood, I'll projectile vomit everywhere. Got water. Gotta stay hydrated. Another water. Gotta stay hydrated. Pasta. As an Italian. Thumbnail. We got this, which I think is a bagel. <laughs> that looks like a. Okay, moving on. Fruit, yogurt, Cheerios, yes! Mm -hmm. Oh, cheddar burger, I think. Yeah, cheddar burger. <laughs> Is this like looking good? Not necessarily. No. Moving on. Okay, orange, vitamin C, apple, whatever vitamin is in here. Reduced fat milk. Am I gonna be able to finish this? <laughs> Chips, cream cheese. Oh yeah, so that's that is a bagel. Okay. That's it. Food haul over. I'm done giving caveman vibes, now we're shaving. So instead of making a time lapse of it, I have decided that I... What the f It looks like I have a double chin, but it's actually the way my... Me making up excuses, me like... So instead of making a time lapse, I have decided that I'm going to attempt to make a transition. Okay, ready? You're gonna see me shaved in three, two, one. Did that... Work at all? So I wanted to make ramen, and the universe didn't want me to. I wanted to make it anyway, so this is what happened. I spilled all of this. <laughs> I don't know what to do because no one's allowed to come into my room. I don't have a vacuum cleaner, so okay, I'm gonna call the <laughs> I'm gonna call the front desk and ask what to do. Ramen powder on the floor. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. She was like, um, I'm gonna see if housekeeping can go to you. And I'm like, I literally have COVID. This is literally a COVID zone. That's the I don't think they're gonna come here. See, like, why? Why? I had a gut feeling. I was like, I should not be in this. But yeah, keep you updated. Three hours later. Please, this is so funny. Okay, this is what they brought me. 
Okay, so they just brought me my vacuum cleaner that I asked for five hours ago. <laughs> so this has been sitting here for the past five hours and it's probably grown roots at this point. I wouldn't be surprised if there are living organisms in it. That was so exciting. Most exciting thing to happen all night.